All right, hi, my name's Jeff Wills, and welcome to Greenbuilt. We're here with the Building Technologies uh, exhibit. Uh, we're part of Siemens. We're talking about smart buildings. You know, if you're familiar at all with the smart grid, that's related to the electrical infrastructure, right? The utility infrastructure, how we get our electricity. But we're, we come at this from a building's perspective. So Siemens' response and how we help our customers respond to smart grid is what we call smart consumption. So what you're seeing here uh, next to me is a model of a building. It's a 3D model of a very sophisticated building of the future, which is we're using to demonstrate how a customer could understand what's happening with smart grid, um, the complexities of some of the things the building might need to do in the future, and really um, just dream a little bit. It's a typical uh, office building, but it's got some unique characteristics. It's getting energy from the utility. It also has renewables such as wind and solar. Um, it's using uh, the ground as a source for heating and cooling, some energy in the ground. Um, it's got an internet connection, of course, right? So it's communicating with the grid and with outside influences to help it understand price signals and what's happening out there. It's got lighting systems that are intelligent, mechanical systems that are intelligent, um, uh, water systems that are intelligently managed. So one of the key things to think about when we talk about smart consumption is that it's not always about consuming less energy, but it's about when you consume it. So maybe using more at night when energy prices are lower and more during the, uh, less during the day when energy prices are high. That still is very um, green, if you will, or, or lends itself to helping us from a, a sustainability perspective because you're not turning on additional power plants during the day. In this building, you might even see the water tank on the roof. It's, it's storing domestic water so that you can pump at night when energy prices are low and, and use gravity during the day to feed your domestic water needs. That's the summary of the, the building of the future and smart consumption as it relates to what's happening with the future smart grid. Thank you very much.